my first race since uh, USA's last year, so it just feels really good to be back. Um, yeah, it's been a long time coming, so I finally got to break out, break out the pro kit and um, have my family here, my coaches, friends, so uh, it was really cool to be able to open up other trials. Um, obviously not an ideal way to open up the season, but just make it the most of it. Take us through, I guess, like what happened over the last couple weeks that eventually led to the green light for you to race here. Yeah, you know, it wasn't like one workout or like a time trial or anything, kind of just like stacking days, consistent good workouts, and um, you know, I had the opportunity because luckily the um, USA was late last year, so I still had a part. So we were like, you know what, let's just see what happens, just go out there and see no expectations and just have fun because I was excited about it. So, you know, we were like, we're excited, we're just going to go. And Coach Hedda said, like, if she didn't think I was ready, she wouldn't push me to do it. So she thought I was ready, so we're, we're just here making the most of it. How much time did you miss due to your injury? Yeah, it was it was pretty wonky. So um, after cross, I pretty much was not consistently running until like late April, early May. Um, cross training a little bit, like on and off, tried coming back to running like two or three times, and just wasn't able to do it. So yeah, it's been a short prep, but really intentional with how I prepared in all aspects of life, so it was like, quick. It was, it was a hamstring issue? Yeah, um, that was my like big main issue, and then trying to come back too quick, not ready, I ended up injuring my back, and then um, I got really bad, like, IT band, um, oh, IT band, team room, IT band, whatever, whatever you want to call it, but yeah, that was actually like, I guess for me, kind of fair, like, the most painful injury I had, but the hamstring was like scary. Like, you gotta be careful with this issue. Um, it wasn't like, as painful as my knee, but yeah, that one was pretty scary. Just because uh, had like a little bit of a tear, and um, yeah, you gotta be careful with those. When did it stop? Was it bothering you during the cross country season at all, or was it off that? Yeah, it's hard to pinpoint because it wasn't like the exact moment where I was like, oh, like, I think I tweaked it. I think it was just like overuse, like, kind of like drained it. Wasn't quite ready, but ran on it, strained it, eventually just like led to like a little bit of a tear. And, um, yeah, it wasn't like a, a huge tear, but where it was, like I just couldn't get to heal. Like, How did you feel today? How did your body feel? Like? Yeah, um, it's an interesting race. Probably the hardest 16 minute 5K of my life. Um, pretty quick last mile, so I was happy with how I hung on. Um, you know, it's hard to run that way, so still not sure like what kind of shape I am. Like. If I went and did like a PR attempt, I, I don't know where I'd be, but I was pretty happy with how today went. Do you think making the team is a realistic goal? Yeah, you know, I'm not going to count myself out. Um, you know, I, I'm just here to compete. I don't I don't have an Olympic standard with how today went. I don't think I would get enough points just because of the time and stuff.